Hey guys, it's Kylie and today I have a video. This is all like the lingo of pin trading So I'm gonna go through like the types of pins and what people call them So the most basic pin here is this is just a rack pin. You just buy them on these black cards um, They usually have a color on the back and that tells you the price So whatever so this is yellow so that would you could look at a board and it will tell you the price But it's just like a basic pin sometimes there's two on a card usually it's just one and you just buy that single pin alone. Then the next type is a booster pack. This is the cheapest way to buy pins. Um, it comes in packs like these. They have like, this one was, I think like, they're about 30 bucks for six pins. They depend on how many pins they have on in them, how many, what the price is. So they come on these like c cards with all six pins. So this is the cat series. So this is a booster pack. Then you have mystery packs. So this is one type of mystery pack. It's these five, like bag ones. There's five in a pack, so this is just like an example of one. So this, the Tsum Tsum one, this is the original set. And these are five pins you can get in it. And on the back of it, it will show you the list of pins that you could possibly get in it. And then you have mystery boxes. So these ones, this one retailed for twelve ninety five um for two right just two open edition pins. It's a cruise line one, so these are two of the pins you could get. And it shows on the back also what you could get. So these ones are for two pins. They usually these are twelve ninety five. The mystery packs are about twenty five bucks. So the pins in these are a little bit nicer. Then one other thing you can get is a these limited edition mystery boxes um, these usually come with one pin um, and these have what they call chaser pins in them so you have the normal set you see on the back that you could all you could get and then you have a chance of getting a chaser pin this is one of the chaser pins and they're a lower limited edition size and on the back of it it says chaser pin Right there it says chaser pin. So that's like a different, another type of pin. So these are the tra chasers. Then you have your hidden Mickeys. That's what they're called. Some people call them cast lanyard series because that's what they used to be called. Um, on the back of it, well this one actually is a cast lanyard. Um, here, let me get, I'll get another one to show you. This one says cast lanyard um, four of four. So there was four in the set. And they all have this little hidden mickey icon on them um this is one of the newer ones and on the back it says hidden mickey pin this one says five of seven or sorry six of seven so that's hidden mickeys you can get those by tr through trading and then a couple years later once they're off the lanyards for once they're not like rotating them through they'll sell, sell them in little bags some mystery bags that you can get them in um, the next type is a PWP. This is a purchase with purchase. So when you spend, uh, I think it's like 20 bucks or something like that. They sometimes do it with like blankets and stuff too. For like three bucks, you can buy a pin. So this is one of the ones I got while on our cruise. You could buy this goofy pin. Um, if you spent, I think it was 20 bucks, you could buy a goofy pin. Some of them are Ellie and some of them are not. So then... LE and LR. So this is limited edition. It means that there's only a certain amount of it. So on the back right here, it's, you can see how it says limited edition of 2,000. So that means there's only 2,000 of this pin that were made. And then this is the LR. So it means they released it for a certain amount of time. So they had it out for whatever, usually uh, like a certain amount of time or until it like ran out but they it's a much higher edition size if it's till they run out Let's see if I can get that to focus so you can see the back of it there we go so it says limited release across the bottom of it and then the last type of pin is a completer pin so this Jafar is a example of a completer pin it was if you bought the whole set of Jafar, there's also a Trinivag one in the series, um, you could get this completer pin. 
Um, they're usually a lower LE for the set. And on them, right here, it says completer pin number one. So, because this one set had two completer pins. Um, so, it's just like a lower LE, a little bit rarer pin that you can get. So, here are the review of the different types. You got your booster pack, your open, ed your open edition rack pin, your mystery bags, your mystery boxes, your limited edition mystery boxes, your... Comp uh, your chaser pins, your hidden mickeys slash cast lanyard, um, your completer, your LE, your LR, and your PWP. So those are the different types of pins that you can get at Disney. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. Check out some of my other Disney pin videos and I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm posting videos every day at 2. Remember to subscribe and turn that bell to get the notifications when the videos go live and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!